Do you hold stablecoins in your wallet without earning yield? If so, you're doing it wrong, I'll tell you why. Let's go and have a look at Twitter. I'm gonna show you a few different DeFi dApps, such as MarginFi. Essentially out there, there's a lot of different dApps that are trying to get you to deposit your stablecoins into them so that you earn a yield and they also earn a yield. So we have MarginFi. Scroll on down a little bit and you can see down here, nice juicy 18.72% with PYUSD. We also have Save, which used to be called Solen. This is one of your OG dApps from 2021 on Solana. You've also got Camino, which just ships and ships and ships. They have the most amount of T TVL. They are aiming to get $10 billion worth of TVL. And as you can see, I just went and took out a loan myself. Then we've got Drift, which is a DEX where you can do longs and shorts and such. But scrolling down, and once again, you're seeing they are trying to get a lot of people to go and deposit their crypto, their USTC, etc., in here and get decent rewards. So everyone's fighting for your rewards, but there's a hidden gem, an absolute hidden gem with under 10,000 followers that you need to be following and actually using. Welcome to Lulo. Lulo has under 10,000 followers and they are Solana original lending aggregator. I do not know anything else that's like this on any other blockchain. This is literally a treasure gem. So scrolling down and you're probably going to see the gist of what they're trying to build in between all of their memes, of course. This is a good picture which sums up what they're doing. Lulo. So you go put your USDC, your Tether and other tokens and it will go and move it to whatever dApp is actually getting you the highest yield. If you put into Camino and then all of a sudden Drift earns more, they get redirected there. If Mango Markets earn more, they go over there. If Save gets more, here, if margin fire gets more, here. Let me show you with an older tutorial address. So this doesn't have a lot of crypto in it, but you can see I've got $138 here and it just goes up and up and up. It's currently all in Camino. The interest earned is $26 and it continues to go up. Of course, you put in more, the interest goes up higher. When we come over to this left-hand side, we can go ahead and we can deposit different tokens, USD coin, PYUSD, USDT, Solana, and so on. And then they get routed to wherever's the best. Let me show you. We can go ahead and deposit at least $100 worth of USDC, USDT, PYUSD, USD, etc. I'm going to go with max because if it's sitting there in my wallet, it's earning nothing. And as soon as I need to withdraw it, I can just go and withdraw it. So we're going to go deposit. I'm going to trust this transaction and approve. That may be something that Soulfly wasn't able to show immediately, but normally it does show you. Click continue. And now we've gone and deposited our USDC. It's just sitting here right now. This is with Camino right now because that's where it's earning the most. Every hour, Lulo checks who's paying the most and they reroute it to that dApp. They only use dApps that have been open sourced and they have been audited themselves. Now, if you do want to decide to withdraw, just click on withdraw. You can withdraw all with max or just whatever you want, like 200. Withdraw, it creates a transaction and it's going to go and withdraw it from the DAP. And, approve. and just like that, we're good to go. Now, I only just showed you with USD coin, but if we click on this, you can see other tokens like PYUSD. Here, you can see there's 18 or 19%, depending on which platform you're using. Click here again, have a look at Solana. There's some that are giving you less than 1%, whereas Camino is giving you almost 5%. USDT, nothing crazy, but you can see the disparity. 5% over with Drift and 12% with MarginFi. So if you've got in Drift, you're losing money unless you route it to MarginFi. Back here, let's have a look at one more. We'll look at Bonk. Not many people pay you to lend out your Bonk. But there are some options out there. I've changed back to my original tutorial wallet because there's one more thing I want to show you. Let's click on rewards. And here we can see different rewards that these dApps have given us. So as an example, because I routed my USDC or USDT via Drift, I actually have 100 Drift tokens to claim. So I can click on claim now. That's $36 worth of tokens just by using Lulo. Approve, and I've claimed my Drift. Same thing with Camino, we can go and claim some Camino tokens, and also we can claim something from Solend, which is now called Save. So that's Lulo, if you're not using it, you're missing out on gains.